Today I'm gonna to be once again cutting with the Fixate insert from Kenna Metal. If you saw our last video, you know this guy is a beast. We were able to take the machine up to 1,000 SFM, feed rate of 24 thousandths, and knock off 400 thousandths of material with one pass. That's unheard of on a lathe. After checking out some of the comments in that video, I thought it would be a good idea to revisit this tool. So what we're gonna be focusing on in this video is we're gonna show the tool life from this tool. We ran it before at 1,000 SFM, but I'm actually gonna dial it back a little bit and we're gonna run it at 800 SFM and we're gonna use a feed rate of 20 thousandths inches per revolution. We're gonna try to get three pieces out of this tool using the same corner, the same insert. This is gonna show the longevity of the tool. We're also gonna get some things that were requested in the comments, like showing the chips coming off of the tool and showing the load monitor on the controller so you can see how hard this machine's being pushed. I'm gonna put a new insert inside the tool and I'll meet you over at the SMX 3100. So we ran our first part. Tool looks pretty good. There's a little bit of wear on the corner, a little bit of discoloration, but I'm really happy with how it's cutting. I've got a nice chip coming off of the cut, so we got nice small curled chips coming off. I'm ready to run the next part. I ran the second piece with the same insert, the same corner. I don't think it looks any worse than the previous one. We still have that black discoloration on the top of the insert. There's a little bit of wear on the corner, but the insert doesn't look any worse than it did before. Let's run another part with this. Third part came out great. Insert still looks good. So we were able to do three parts, the same insert, same corner. It really doesn't look any worse for wear on the corner. I could totally get another three parts or more from the same tool. We could run a lot more of them, but we're gonna stop there for today. So for all three parts, I ran it at 800 SFM with the chip load of 20 thousandths per revolution. And I did a variable depth of cut to ease off of the torque on the machine. It started with a 200 thousandths depth of cut and every pass increased it up to a maximum of 400 thousandths, which it did for the last few passes. Those speeds and feeds puts us at an MRR of 76.8 cubic inches per minute at the maximum depth of 400 thousandths. Even at the minimum depth at the start of the cut, we're still getting a respectable MRR of 38.4 cubic inches per minute. That's insane. I'm really happy with the performance of the Fixate. I'm glad I was able to rough out these parts no problem. And it's really cool seeing material fly off that quick on a lathe. So thank you very much for watching. If you like this video and you like what we're doing, make sure you hit the like and subscribe, click on the bell for the notifications, and I'll see you next time. Thanks for watching.